Now, when you first open up the more recent editions of Microsoft Excel, the starting interface is referred to as the splash screen or the introductory page to the Office application, in this case, Excel. Now, when I first open up Excel, I get taken to this screen here where I've got some larger icons on the left-hand side. I've got Home, New, Open, and I've got a few little links down at the bottom. Now, on the right-hand side, I've got a blank workbook. That's what we're going to start out with, just a blank standard Excel workbook, something that we can start to create on our own. You've got some little tutorials or tours of some new features that were introduced in your current version of Excel. And then you've got the recent documents and templates that you can get into, templates being over here on the right-hand side. Now, this is newer, this interface right here. I'm, I'm using the Office 365 subscription, so I have the latest version of Excel open in front of you right now. Now, what you might have on your screen when you first launch Excel might be a couple of things. One, you may have got a blank workbook right away, already open up on your screen. It might look like this right there. Just launch Excel and you've got a blank workbook. It may look like if I go to file new, it might look something like this right here. Now, just again, just a heads up. When you first open up Excel, your interface might look a little bit different just based on the version that you're working on. If you're on a Mac, it's going to look a little bit different beyond what you're seeing here as well. That's one of the biggest differences between the Windows version of Excel and the Apple or Mac version of Excel is really the interface. The features that we'll be discussing here are going to apply to ooh, from the 2003 version even, way back when, 2003, 2007, 2010, 2013, 2016, uh, everything that we talk about is going to apply to any of those versions. So you're going to feel very comfortable. But there might be some little tweaks such as this startup screen, the splash screen, when you first launch the application itself. Okay, so just a little heads up there, but nothing big. Okay? If you've got any questions, if it's like, hey, I didn't see that outside of my application, or how come you don't have this, I have it inside of mine, go to the Q&A section of the course and ask your questions. Right, Even supply sn snapshots, screenshots of what you're seeing, because that'll help me better understand perhaps what version you're working in, and I can guide you through where the command might be or how the buttons are a little bit different. So again, just a heads up that the interface itself might look a little bit different when you first open up the application. Um, but nonetheless, you're still going to get to all the same features. So this is your startup screen. It's great. It's going to give you several options to be able to work with new documents or existing documents. Take a moment, try exploring, just take a look at what you have open in front of you. And then we'll jump into the next video and we'll create one of our own workbooks and get a deeper understanding of the Excel interface.